<clears throat> Dear diary. Yes, this is another part of this diary. Uh it's now Wednesday. It's uh twelve seventeen AM and it's sixteen degrees outside, but that's subject to be changed because of the weather. So um uh, the day went fine. I finished Snatcher today. And with a few touch with all the touches from the you know, NEC ports and the MSX ports. It's quite a nice thing to uh, to actually play that. A quote at the end that says, Throughout history, suspicion always breaks conflict. This conflict resides in people's hearts. That conflict has just begun. So fucking true. Like, really, it's... It's so fucking true. And it will just always be true till this day. Uh, suddenly, I feel a very bad sore throat for some reason. I just got out of the shower. And um, it's night time, and I'm supposed to be sleeping for college tomorrow. But of course not without the, a batch of thoughts and regrets and, sh and flashbacks coming on at me. And um, it's really terrible. It's really terrible that with all this time you're barely making any progress on moving on. Like seriously, this is, and this is how hard and how far the fucking internet is gonna take to literally screw over someone's goddamn life in real life and online like jesus fucking christ and i'm gonna be real like if it really wasn't for that goddamn suspicion like this world, this fucking world would have been much better, whether it's online and or IRL. And on top of that, they really just can't stop. Like, what in the world is wrong with this fucking world? It's simple. We are barely barely making any fucking improvements on what we used to be at the old and ancient ages especially at times like the world war the gulf uh, war or the uh, crusades war or most of the you know prophets uh, conquests or like um you know Literally all the other wars, or the French Revolution, basically, we're just being no different. And we're just slowly descending down, really. And, and honestly, I think we are almost close to World War Three. And if some dumbass out there had, uh, like, outbroke it, personally, I'd be so fucking happy. Not only because I would get to die after one day, but honestly, it would be like hopefully a wake up call to all those fuckers out there who think that all of this is gonna fucking be internal and they can just keep fucking, you know, trick and suspect people. And like, not only that, but. Within a few hours or overnight, the like the human overnight can now actually fuck someone over by literally the dirtiest ever set up. There's lots of people that also the ones that they trusted, and then literally put him up in a really shitty corner and bang. And again, this method is nowadays being done no problem, whether online or in real life. 
know, supposedly this shower would have made me forget, but no sign of any fucking improvements. Snatcher? Well, I guess it should have made me forget, but you know how it gets. Yeah, I just miss those days. I miss those days when I really, really, really didn't have to get off my circle and literally just go beyond a few servers and a few friends who are actually, you know, being caring to you. And, um, with a timeline like this, there is absolutely no doubt that, um, we live in a society. In other words, out of all the rambling, I really wish I could just move on that easily. I know it's been like two weeks or something, but I can't get over it. I literally can't get over it. It was just that hard. And like, no one ever understands that I am completely fucking depressed and really have turned old before actually turning old. <sighs> like, you know, <sighs> it's almost a mistake being born as a guy. Really. Like, if you're born as a woman, then prepare to have a very, very amazing life. Really. You're gonna be completely simped on, praised, you know, get being given lots of things and out of absolutely nowhere. Whether it's by multiple men or women, it's you're literally gonna be fucking blessed. But if you're a guy, if you're older, you're you're simply getting fucked in the ass for <laughs> being a guy. Like, for fuck's sakes, you know, for fuck's sakes, the guys in my, the men in my country are going to be forced to, to be in an army after they finish college. Like, the fuck, man? <sighs> oh, well. I guess this is just how it is. You know, whether you are a manly man, or you are simply a pawn to get completely a bait to be fucked in the ass. Now, I know what most of you are thinking right now. Oh god, please stop. No, I'm not stopping. Really. Cause, um... I'm pretty sure everyone else in my position would have done that. But then, like, who really cares? Or why should, why should anyone even care, you know? Everyone just does what they want, you know? They just kill, or steal, or jeopardize, traumatize, completely, you know destroy or you know just anything you know they just do it you know they just do it no consideration or thinking or logic or reasoning or anything you just do it because um what else is supposed to be when you just need to do it because it's fucking easy to y'all So, let's be real. Honestly, I fucking hate America. Yeah. I'm gonna just go all out and say I fucking hate America. I now hate America. I don't wanna, I don't wanna travel. I don't, like, yeah, I don't wanna even travel abroad. At all. You know, I'm just gonna stick to my country 
And if I have ever got past college, I'm going to actually just get myself a house with my limited, with ever saying that is limited. But I don't give a shit. You know why? Because it's easier to stick to your place. Or you're just going to get fucked over more. Like, come on. Like, come on. Why? Just why? <sighs> and honestly, and honestly, there's no goddamn reason for me to fucking move on. Really? I need to work hard anymore. Working hard is no longer an option for me. And whether I die or completely get fucked over more in real life is not going to be surprising to me anymore. <sighs> yeah, I'm just going to be completely real. But if there's anything that would completely make me forget but then it would make me a child or whatsoever, then I guess, let's go ahead. Let's just go ahead. Let's just go ahead and completely do it. If it's from it to move on and to completely forget that you ever have been in a place or have ever known anyone, then fuck it. <sighs> I think that's about it for me. Tomorrow's gonna be a pretty rough college day, as always. But then, luckily, it's my dad's second day of being outside. Out of the house, cause, you know, he's out for three days. On that business trip. And it's gonna be ending at uh, this Friday, I think. So, uh... Yeah, hopefully it's, um, hopefully I can move on, because honestly, I really, really, really want to forget everything more than ever before, like way more than ever before, if there's a fucking virtual drug or real life drug to take to forget i would absolutely and gladly take it right fucking now just literally let me forget and move on <sighs> all right that's it for me